Hello, this is Sonia from my happy space. Welcome back at my channel. I'm going to do another memory index memory card or memory verse. Um, and if you're interested, I've got a YouTube video how I made this uh, memory index box myself. So you can check that out. I'll put it in the description box. So what I'm going to do is we're going to document or I'm going to learn 1 John 1 verse 8 to 9. My kids and myself is always learning verses during the term. I'm homeschooling them. So this is going to be one of the verses we're going to learn this term. Term, and I just thought it'd be nice to decorate it and put it in my memory index box. So what I'm going to do is I'm doodling herbs here. I'm following a lady called Shada Campbell. I will put her YouTube channel also in the description box and see shows you easy tutorials how to do um, flowers or herbs and things like that. So this is what I'm doing now. So it's very easy. I've chosen a few herbs. Here I'm doing basil or basil, depends on how you, where you are in the, in the world, how you pronounce it. Um, so it's just nice and easy, big loopy leaves. Next to it, I'm doing lavender. I think I, I was thinking it's lavender, but I don't know if it was at the end the lavender or the thyme I've, I drew. I got a little bit confused with some of the herbs. But anyway, ended up being lavender. It sort of um, looks very much the same. This is... Um, chives I'm drawing here with a little bit of a flower on top. The next one is a celery I'm going to draw. Um, it doesn't look very much like it but it's supposed to be the long stems with the sort of the flower at the top or the the opening of the celery. So yeah that's what I'm doing at the moment. The next one is rosemary I'm drawing with the it's just these small little heart-shaped or oval-shaped leaves, which I'm just drawing very simply. So yeah, I just want to read you the verse I'm documenting. It's 1 John 1 verse 8 to 9. It says, If we say we have no sin, we deceive ourselves, and the truth is not in us. But if we confess our sins, he is faithful and just to confess forgive us our sins and to cleanse us from all unrighteousness. 1 John 1 verse 8 to 9, as I said. Yeah, it's a good news of the gospel. Um, if we we need to know we are of sin to know that we what we are saved from, otherwise it's not good news. But the good news is that if we confess our sin, he is faithful and he will forgive us and he will cleanse us. Um, yeah, that is the wonderful good news of the gospel and I think it's a wonderful verse to learn. As you saw, I didn't finish the mint um, herb I drew because I knew I was going to put the verse on top. The mint is an interesting herb. It's just these three big leaves with the small leaves inside. And it has these rough little edges around it. So, And then it's got lots of veins inside. So that was, yeah, it's, it's interesting leaf too. It looks complicated, but if you break it down, you take it um, bit by bit, it's easier to do. I'm just drawing the rectangular block around it just to make it stand out. This is a clever way also to make a birthday card. Just to draw a rectangular in the middle, put the person's name in it and put some flowers or herbs around it and water coloring it in. And yeah, that's, as I said, it's very nice and to do it like that. It looks impressive, um, but it is easy to make. So I'm just grabbing my watercolouring pencils. I thought I'm going to do use that because um, it's the small little, uh, the points of the watering colour pencils could go in, but then I realised I don't have the right colours because lavender is purple and um, the rosemary is sort of the silvery blue, or not silvery grey rather, so I had to mix it. So I just grabbed a little plastic bag and I put water on top of it and I just mix the color just as I would have done with any water coloring at the end. And I just use this fine little paintbrush and I, I'm just using to color it in. As I said, my, I'm homeschooling my kids and we um, learn each, each term we learn four verses, um, at least four verses. Um, so we have a daily verse. We have a day of a week verse. We have an odd and even verse. Like means if it's an odd day, like the 3rd of, of August, and then we've got an even day if it's the 4th of August or the 6th or the 8th. Um, and then we've got the day of the month verse also. So for instance, if it's the 10th of the month, we um, learn that verse also. So we end up going over four verses 
every day. And it's very interesting um, how the different learning styles or the different capability we have. My daughter probably takes by the end of the week, she already knows all four verses. My son takes maybe a bit longer, he's a bit younger. I literally take almost the whole term to learn the four verses. Um, it's just kids' brains are so much they like a sponge. They just learn things so much easier. But um, yeah, it's just good to learn these verses because I'm always saying the Holy Spirit cannot bring things, recall things in your mind if you haven't read it or haven't gone over it. So it's our responsibility or it's our privilege to learn the word of um, the God, um, the word of God, God. Yeah, the word of God, and then He will bring the Holy Spirit will bring it forth when we need it. Um, he will recollect it. He will bring it forth um, fast in our, in our minds so we can use it, speak life into people's life. So, yeah, I will really encourage you to to learn the scripture. This is just a very easy way to do it. It's called the Charlotte Mason way, which you just basically repeat the verses over and over day by day without trying to get it into your head and try to memorize it. And by the end of a period of time, however long it takes you, you will just automatically know the verse. So yeah, it's just a it's a good way to do it. Um, I so say I'm just coloring it. I'm trying to do a variation of different greens. You might not be able to see it very much um very well in the video, but to do to use darker greens, lighter greens, and obviously I've got a little purple for the lavender, and I've got the grey blue for the for the rosemary. Um, yeah, I'm just loving herbs. It's just, it's, it makes it so lovely to cook with herbs. I'm, I'm just all the different smells and everything of herbs. I'm, I'm just loving it. I rather use herbs than I use any salt or pepper or things like that. So I'm just sticking the memory verse in the middle. I really enjoy doing this um, memory card, and I'm really going to enjoy learning this verse. And yeah, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, if you want to see more of these type of videos, please like and subscribe. And I hope to see you soon. Bye-bye.